Hey, I know and you know that this giant spider in Croatia is nothing more than so fake, it's funny. But since so many of you guys have sent it in, we're gonna show you today a huge blooper that was made by this big faker. We're also gonna take a look at this picture of a huge lobster said to be real. A picture of a spider that looks too big to be real. A picture that claims to show one of the biggest turtle shells ever found. And a video that may have caught the biggest crocodile ever recorded on camera. It's gonna be a real giant of a show, but hey, before we get into all that, I just wanna welcome back Blue Apron, those people that keep me fed so well, and who, drum roll please, just happen to be sponsoring today's video. We all live in a crazy world these days with less time to cook than ever. But no matter how crazy things get, like right now in my house where we're doing a kitchen remodel, Blue Apron delivers all the farm fresh ingredients you need right to your doorstep. This is space age, look at this. This has got everything inside, let me just dump it right out. Individually wrapped. Whoa, guys, <laughs> we're trying to cook here? You think maybe, can we do something more? Yeah. yeah. Today we're gonna be doing pan fried chicken, but we gotta hurry before Nick and Scott get to the stove, so. All meals can be prepared in 40 minutes or less, and here's the great thing. The first 100 people to sign up will get $40 off your first two weeks of Blue Apron. Just click the link in the description box and you're on your way. Blue Apron offers you eight recipes each and every week, and you can choose any combination you like. That keeps you away from eating the same old, same old, or ordering takeout. Prices start at $9.99 per serving, and guess what? There's no commitment. You can cancel at any time. Whoa! I guess we're done. Mmm! Man, this is so good. I am good, man. I am good. You see? Even if your world is as crazy as mine, you can still come up with a really good meal with Blue Apron. You guys are always sending in pictures and videos of giant creatures because you guys just love those things. So today I thought we might have some fun by picking out five of those submissions that really test your brains. Let's go. Is it possible this is a real lobster that man is holding? Or did somebody with a new copy of Photoshop play around with reality? The picture was sent in by Corin Lloyd, who just asked, hey, Bill, is this real? Well, Corin, a quick look around the internet will show you literally hundreds of postings of some of the biggest lobsters you have ever seen. Like this, this, and even this. But as far as this one goes, you know, I'm not so sure, and I wasn't the only one. Ilana James on Facebook wrote, if it were real, I think the pincers would be much bigger. That's a good point, Ilana, because you know, when you look closer at those pincers, they kind of look like, you know, they've been manipulated or somebody drew in there. So let's see what the official answer says here so we can figure out whether you guys voted correctly or wrongly. And the official answer is real. Anand Tyson was the first one to get a handle on this picture and lead us to the man who took the picture, Ron Belanti. It is 100% real. I was the one who pulled the net up over the side with it in it and uh, we pretty much just stood there with our jaws dropped open when we looked up, so I don't think it was. Well, so what kind of lobster is that? Where was it caught and how much did it weigh? It's a, it's a California spiny lobster. It was caught off Long Beach, California, and it weighed 12 and a half pounds. Wow, 12 and a half. That's got to be a record. Is that like the largest spiny lobster ever? It actually is not. Believe it or not, I don't know about the actual world record, but I do know that there was one caught and it weighed over 18 pounds. <laughs> 
18 pounds. That, that's a monster. Unbelievable. Number four is this mammoth spider that looks like something out of a science fiction movie. The picture was sent in by J.K. Blaze Random who wrote, Can a spider really be that big? J.K., I have personally witnessed some monster spiders on my travels. Like this tarantula we came across in Brazil. That thing was huge. But then when they get really ginormous, like the one we're gonna be taking a look at in just a couple of seconds, I mean, you know, it's just so obvious that it's BFF or Big Fat Fake. But, you know, when it comes to something like this, I mean, that thing is huge, but I think twice about whether it's fake or real, you know? I mean, to me, I mean, let's look at the spider again. It looks a little plasticky, doesn't it? Like maybe, it was on sale at Toys R Us before they went out of business? Never know. Okay, well, what do you say we take a look at the official answer and see if your vote was correct or not? Here we go. All right, and the official answer is that spider is 100% real. Thanks to Facebook super sleuth Anand Tyson who got us this newspaper article, we now know that this is a huntsman spider and may be one of the biggest of that species ever found. And just in case you're wondering, the official title of the world's largest spider goes to the Goliath Bird Eater. This mega spider can weigh as much as a newborn puppy when fully grown. Is it possible this is the biggest turtle shell ever found? The picture was sent in by Dylan Kendall who wrote, is this real or BFF as in big fat fake? Dylan, when I saw this picture, I mean, the instant I saw it, I said, oh, that's real, because, you know, it's, it's just a snapshot. Who would make something like that up? But then again, a lot of high-powered talent out there with a lot of high-powered technology who have nothing better to do than try to prank us and fake us all day long. So let's see what the official answer is here. And, uh, well, this one's a little bit complicated. So did you vote real? or fake, because we do, we do come down to one answer and one answer only. Okay, so let's, let's address, it's got two parts. The picture showing the turtle shell and the woman are real, okay? Now, the claim that it is the biggest turtle shell ever found is real. So you got two reals, it's real. The first one to get to the bottom of this one was Facebook researcher Isaac Sisson, who dug up the fact that this shell is on display at the Tennessee Aquarium in Chattanooga, Tennessee. The shell was found in Venezuela in 1972. It belongs to an extinct turtle known as the Stupendemis geographicus. This thing was so big, it could have given Gamera a run for its money. Number two, in this video, what looks like an easygoing water safari turns into a jaw-dropping crocodile sighting. Look at the size of that thing. The video was sent in by Prajwal Nayak who asked, Bill, is this the biggest crocodile ever caught on tape? Prajwal, first off, if I was in a boat like that size and I saw a crocodile that big, I would be like, Okay, time to head back to the lodge, like, immediately. But seriously, while the video does look real, the claim that that's the biggest crocodile ever recorded, well, you know, that's, that's kind of a tough one. I mean, as far as I know, the biggest crocodile ever caught on tape was Lo Long in the Philippines, and that wasn't just a shadow under the water. Okay, so let's just take a look here and see what we have on the official answer, okay? And here's what it says. The video showing the crocodile swim out from underneath the boat is real. The claim that it is the biggest crocodile ever caught on camera is unknown. Because the crocodile was never captured and measured, there is no real way to tell how long it was or how much it weighed. So for now, the title for biggest croc on camera remains Lo Long from the Philippines. May he rest in peace. 
number one. Our final entry today is this amazing picture of some scientists who unearthed the world's largest scorpion remains. Regina Tanbinki sent this in and wrote, hey Bill, is this real or fake? Regina, I can't tell you how many of these scientists unearthing the bones of giants come into Bill's channel every week because there are so many of them, like this one, this one, and this one. But as far as I know, this is the only one showing a giant scorpion, which might mean it's real. So let's take a look here. Uh, because we know in the past there were some ginormous animals. When they do the humans, you're like, I'm like, oh, please. But let's see what it says here. Uh, okay, well, the picture showing scientists unearthing the remains of a giant scorpion is 100% and accurately fake. In this case, I didn't even have to put the picture on my Facebook because the answer on this one was right down here in the lower left-hand corner. It reads worth 1,000, and if you've never heard of it, it was a Photoshop contest website that produced more viral fake photos than any page on the internet. Okay, well, that's all the time I have for this video, but hey, don't click away just yet because we've got that video of the ginormous spider with the huge blooper in it, so you don't wanna miss this. But before I do that, I just wanna send out a big thanks to all you people who send in all those crazy videos every week. Also wanna send a super special thanks to my Facebook research team who are always out there unearthing the truth for us. And hey, don't forget, we've got a new show every Friday, and if you've got a picture or a video and you're not quite sure whether it's real or not and wanna get it into the show, send it in to me at billschannel at gmail.com and I'll take a look. Please don't leave links or suggestions in the comment section because the only thing that's going to do is turn me into a big creepy creature screaming, you're, you're driving, driving me, me crazy. crazy! See you next time. Okay, now as far as this video is concerned, here's the major blooper. You see it right here? This plane passes behind the spider. But if you compare the size of that plane to the buildings down here, which are closer to us, you can see a huge mistake by the video maker. There is no plane in this world that is even remotely close to being that big. Can you spell super fake?